The most recent version of the JCT suite of contracts is 2016. In this video, we'll explain the management JCT contract options. The traditional or conventional JCT contracts are still by far the most used contracts. Our videos on the traditional and design and build options can be found in the description below. Before we start, if you're enjoying our videos, please subscribe and hit the notification button to be the first to see our videos every Wednesday. Management Building Contract The price is based on prime cost of the project, plus a management fee for the management contractor. Interim payments are monthly, unless otherwise stated. This contract is divided into two periods, the pre-construction period and the construction period. The management contractor should be appointed early, so they can cooperate with the architect or contract administrator, quantity surveyor and other members of the professional teams on such matters as project program, formulating and agreeing construction methods. In the construction period, the management contract will be required to set out, manage, organize, supervise and secure the carrying out and completion of the project through the works contractor, who are all directly contracted to them. Although the management contractor is responsible for operating the terms of the contract, the consequences of any default by a worked contractor do not fall upon the management contractor if they comply with such terms. This contract is most appropriate for large-scale projects, requiring an early start on site but where it's not been possible to prepare full design information before the works commence. Construction Management Appointment This contract is used when the employer is looking to appoint a construction manager to work on behalf of the employer. The cost to the construction manager is based on the construction manager's fee plus certain reimbursable costs, such as fuel. Construction Management Trade Contract This contract is to be entered into between the employer and the trade contractor in conjunction with the construction management appointment, and because it's a direct contractual agreement, it's not classed as a subcontract but more akin to a main contract. The construction manager acts as an agent for the employer in issuing instructions, making decisions and preparing certifications. Price is based on either lump sum or complete remeasurement. Interim payments are either monthly or at predetermined stages. For an explanation on the management procurement route, please click the link below. Matrone, a commercial hub to your business.